Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you how can you install FreePBX in your environment. By using this method you can install FreePBX and use as a media gateway and connecting your VoIP telephone to that. You can use this method to create a VoIP system in your office or home. At the first, I have to download free PBX. Click on download. Fill this information. After that, click on download free PBX. I have already downloaded this file in my desktop. Let me show you. This is. Now I'm going to create a new visual machine. I'm using Hyper-V. You can use physical server or VMware environment. Next, write the name. Next, next. Four gigabyte is enough. Next, select your network interface. Next, and that's enough for this next select install operation system from bootable cd select image file and select downloaded file next finish start this visual machine as you can see we have different options here i used first one as you can see that's recommended Press enter. Also, I use the first one in this section. Enter. And press enter to start installation. FreePBX use CentOS 7 as a core OS. This is CentOS installation wizard. You can follow these steps. Select your region. done select installation destination okay as you can see my disk selected and automatically partition now configure your network interface This information depends on your environment. Turn on network interface. And this is your host name. Click on apply. Done. Okay, configuration finished. Click on begin installation, set your root password, no. depend on your environment, it takes 10 minutes usually.
Okay, free PBX installation completed. Click on reboot. Okay. At this time, I'm using web browser to log into my free PBX. Okay, as you can see, my free is running. At the first time, you have to fill this information. This username and password used to manage your VoIP system. Don't touch anything and click on setup system. Okay, that's enough. Okay, that's it. Click on FreePBX administration and write your username and password. Select your language. Submit. Now this is FreePBX default firewall configuration. You can click on continue and click on next on everything. Don't touch anything. As you can see, automatically everything will be configured. Okay, that's finished. Now at this time, I have to create an extension. From application, click on extensions. Click add extension. Select new zip, page zip extension. User extension. That's depend on you. As you can see, I use this information and also you can use same as my environment. Click on submit. Don't forget every after every change, click on apply config. I have created 3001 extension. Now I'm going to install Zoiper VoIP system as a software IP phone. Okay, let's start. I have already downloaded Zoiper IP phone. Next, accept. Next, next, next. You can use all default settings. Don't touch anything.
finish. Now open Zoiper. Continue as a free user. As you can see, my extension is 3001 and password is double three 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 zero zero one three zero zero one at that's your free pvx ip address let me check ten zero two zero zero two zero zero and password click on login click on next skip now system detected as you can see cpudp found click on next okay now my 3001 extension registered on free pbx now create another extension Click on submit. Okay, I'm creating another extension. Click on apply config. Okay. This is my another PC in my network and I'm going to install Zoiper also on it and register with extension 3002 and make a call to another extension. Open Zoiper website. Select your platform and click on download. Download. Wait for four seconds. Okay, I was downloaded Zoiper to my PC earlier. I'm going to install that. Click on next. Accept. Next. 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 Finish. Now I'm going to register with 3002 extension and make a call to 3001.
continue as a free user This is your free PBX IP address. Login. Also, this is your free PBX address. Click on next. You can skip microphone and speaker configuration. As you can see, this extension register on the system. I am going to create a phone call to 3001 As you can see I have a call from 3002 and I can accept or reject that click on accept I hope this video was useful for you to set up VoIP system in your office or home and make a free call with any computer or VoIP telephone. Please subscribe to my channel and if you have any question you can ask in the comments. Don't forget to watch other videos in my channel and like them. Have a good day. Bye bye.